Money Entertainment. And if you've never been to my channel before, on Fridays we keep it real with topics that's trending on social media or people ask me to talk about. And today's topic is, was requested by one of my subscribers. So the topic is dating over 40. And I think when you hit 40 and over and you are still single, then it's a difference from dating when you're 30 because you are now at the age of you know what you want. You're, you either have your career, you are more stable, and you don't have time to filter out negativity of dates. So when you started to date, I think the most important thing is to sit down and write down what you are looking for in the person that you want to date. This way, it gives you a list of what you are going to uh, want out of a lover. I don't think that if you don't write it down, then you'll end up accepting, thinking that you can fix someone. And I think that's the problem with dating before you're 40 years old. We have the concept of we can fix that person because we fell in love with that person or that person showed us the best of themselves in the first year. Uh, so we could get ahead and stop them from drinking or, or uh, stop them from going to jail or uh, help them get ahead and get a job. Well, at the age of 40 and over, you want them to be just as independent as you are. And I think when you write what you're looking for and don't stray from what you're looking for, it'll be easier to filter out the garbage of those that you don't have time for. You'll also come to a conclusion when you're 40 years old on your future as a senior. Because in 10, 20 years, you're gonna be a senior. You want to be able to have someone that you know will take care of you if you get ill. Someone that you can trust in your home. Someone who's not going to cheat on you. That's why I don't believe in when you're 40 to date somebody that's in their 20s because they have not found um, their niche in life yet. And they're looking and searching for their niche. Where someone that's 40 and older knows exactly what they want. Is it harder to date when you're 40 and over? I don't think so. Um, if you're not the bar type, don't go to the bar. If you want to be on social media, put in uh, aspects to protect yourself. Google search them if you're starting to catch feelings. See if they got a, a, a criminal record. These things are open records that you can get ahead and find. It may cost you a couple of dollars, but at the end, it's worth it because you will know exactly who you are dating. I also believe that you can't just rush in to dating. 
You have to get to know that person. And to get to know that person, if you're online, you can date online. You could both get movies and uh, watch them together. You know, our technology these days makes no excuse for someone to date someone who they've never seen before. Uh, to get catfished. Um, because we have the technology to FaceTime each other, to message each other. I believe at the age of 40 and over, your love knife is not over. You can still date if you choose to date or date to look for someone as a potential husband or wife. I also believe that whether you're a man or a woman, at the age of 40, it's mostly if you're independent, you're mostly looking to settle down, not to play the field. So hit me up in a comment. Are you single and are you 40 or over? And how do you get ahead and date? Do you date online? Do you date in person? And how do you figure out, are there safe to date? Do you do a background check? Do you do a Google search? Hit me up in the comment. Let's talk about it. Because you know what time it is. It's Friday. And I'm tired. And I'm out. Peace.